Welcome back to my students to a brand new episode of Comic Class. In today's video, guys, I want to talk about Deadly Class and really quick talk about something I saw on Twitter on Wes Cred's uh, Twitter page. And basically, someone had asked him and brought up the question that apparently the final story arc of Deadly Class is being collected in trade paperback uh, format, just like the rest of the Deadly Class series. But apparently, uh, a fond farewell was put into like part one. And I guess there should be a part two. And the guy basically had asked Wes Craig if this was a mistake on Amazon's part, if maybe they had misled, uh, you know, the fans basically by, you know, putting part one. But it turns out that uh, it wasn't a mistitle basically uh, by Amazon. They didn't mistitle it. And that apparently a fond farewell is going to be in part one and part two. Um, so it's going to be a two part uh, story arc. So, there's many ways we can look at this. One of them is that this story arc could go for 8 issues, it might go for 10, it might be go for 12. Uh, more than anything, I'm guessing it will go for 12 issues, being an entire year's worth of story uh, line. And to, you know, finally, you know, end off the Deadly Class series with a great uh, finale issue, I'm guessing. Uh, you know, maybe on the 12th issue of this story arc. And yeah, I want to bring this to the channel uh, for people that are watching uh, for my Deadly Class content. Um, and kind of like look into this channel for some news uh, whenever it comes out. Um, I do like to try to talk about Deadly Class news whenever it drops. And I don't follow West Cred, so I didn't see this right away. But I, for some reason, felt like going to checking out in the last, uh, I think I saw this about five days ago. Um, and I decided to just make a video talking about it and let you guys know about uh, a fond farewell. It's supposed to be in two parts if you don't know that already. It's going to be two volumes long, so this could mean that it's going to be like 8, 10, or 12 issues. Or any number, you know, around that range. Uh, it could be. Uh, there was an indefinite uh, issue count uh, given by Westcred, so I don't know. Uh, maybe I can ask him and see if he answers on Twitter. Um, you know, on his Twitter page, maybe if I ask him a question on how long the arc is supposed to run for, the story arc is supposed to run for, maybe he'll uh, give me that answer, but I don't know. I'm getting thinking they're going to want to keep it a secret, keep us on our toes, basically, when, uh, looking at this finale, and really just experiencing it instead of waiting for it to end, you know, by giving us a definite uh, issue count. Um, and yeah, an issue number count basically of how long we have until the series ends. And you know, just uh, let me know what your thoughts are on a fond farewell basically being, you know, maybe 12 issues long. Uh, do you guys think that's awesome that they're giving a good amount of time for this finale? And it looks like we're gonna get another time jump in the next issue. I'm hoping that's not the case. Um, you know, I think it might be the next issue, might be the issue after that, that we might have a time jump by looking at the covers for the issues uh, that we have gotten released so far. But um, let me know if you guys think that's a good idea. I personally don't really want another time skip, but rather it just, you know, in the way that it is now with them at the ages they are now, it just deal with the story on where it is now. Uh, but we'll see how it all turns out, and who knows, maybe it's going to be done really well. And I'll really enjoy it instead of, you know, it staying where it is now. Uh, but yeah, until next video, guys, God bless you. Until the next lesson, keep on reading those comments.